So the next one, this is a really fun one. Two of the best younger quarterbacks in the league. We got Houston at Seattle. The Seahawks Since are... when is Russell Wilson a young quarterback? Well, he's younger. I mean, you know. Well. But he's still... I mean, how long has he been in the league? Like five years? Yeah, he, he hasn't been around as long as you think. He's still... He's still made. The Seahawks are giving five and a half points to Houston. This could be an interesting situation yeah, where you might want to take the dog because they might lose but still uh, cover. I don't know. What do you... What do you guys think? The I don't Seahawks. See Seattle covering that spread. I don't. I'm not necessarily seeing saying Houston wins though. I'm taking Houston to actually win. Okay. Wow. Because, um, their offense was. I mean, they just had a bye week last week. Yeah. But before that, the last two games, uh, Hopkins has been playing great. Yes. Uh, we're probably one of the best receivers in the NFL right now. Um, Deshaun, what was it? Deshaun Watson. Watson, yeah. Uh, he's he's one of those guys that usually I can get an inside scoop on a guy before he kind of blows up or, or starts playing really well. He's one of those guys that I was like right out of nowhere. Just like this yeah. guy can – he throws a good ball. He makes Blame good decisions, you know. Uh, so I would say that uh, I think Houston – and they got a good D. Yeah. You know, but without J.J. Watt – they struggle, obviously, right. but I, I'll take you. I would take Houston. Okay. Yeah. And for those of you wondering about Tom discovering people, this is a guy who hosted a sports show in New Hampshire. Mm -hmm. Knew about Conor McGregor before he. Yep, I met before he was famous. So yeah. he knows That's what he's dope. actually talking yep. about. Yep. Actually, I, I would give most people shit for saying that, but he actually knows what he's talking about. <laughs> <laughs> but, and actually, you know, the the Houston pick that takes balls, and I love it. I can't go against the Seahawks at home. They're so good at. Either. They're so good at home. That crowd. You know, most of the time, Vegas will give you three points at home. I feel like when you're at Seattle or New Orleans or a couple of these places, it, they have extra energy there. Yeah. They're just more brought to them. I would, I, I think Seahawks laying five, it's it's tough, but um, I, I would swallow the pill and do it because I think so Sean Watson is five? Yeah, five and a half. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, and, I, and, uh, and five and a half is usually the zone where Vegas isn't really sure of what the game is going to be, right. actually. It's more of a tenuous situation. Because, because it's in that zone where Vegas isn't really sure, uh, you could go with Tom's pick. I think it's a really smart pick. I'm going to take Seahawks at home, to be yeah, honest. I got, I got Seahawks at home, but they don't cover the spread. I'd say about three. But I, I think if you go with Tom, that could easily work. I, uh, this, is not a, this is not a game where I think it's one way or the other, for sure. Yeah, it's not a uh, Yeah, so... 